Hey everybody, my name is Drew Hitt and I'm a Canadian cinematographer and DP. In today's review video, we're diving into my detailed hyper review of the Lang Master Camera Stabilizer. We'll be looking at the product features, overall build quality, and break down each section of the rig, including the sled, arm, vest features, as well as demo examples shot on this rig. Let's dive into it. Lang has been in the business of manufacturing high-end camera gear since 2003, and although they may not be the first name that comes to mind when you think of Steadicam, they sure give them a run for their money. In the past, if you've wanted to become an industry Steadicam operator, the financial barrier to entry was quite high, but not anymore. For a quick comparison, the Steadicam Archer 2 costs over $25,000 US, while the Lang Master Stabilizer comes in at only $4,999 for the entire kit. I've been lucky enough to film some commercials and test footage with this stabilizer on the Red Komodo, paired with the C-Ray 24-85mm full-frame cine zoom lens, and I've been pleasantly surprised with the superior build quality, vest comfort, customizability, and overall rig operation. Product Features The Lang Master Stabilizer features a lightweight telescoping carbon fiber post and sled with precision adjustable V-mount battery, universal monitor mounts, and a high load bearing shock arm that can support full cinema camera setups up to 50 pounds. The included high comfort vest offers adjustability for the chest, hips, and shoulders, and offers a comfortable fit for all size camera operators to disperse the rig's weight across your entire body and reduce operator fatigue. It features a high strength and high precision shock arm designed to accommodate a wide range of operating needs and has a weight range from 8 to 50 pounds. The kit comes with an included heavy duty road travel case with wheels, butterfly latches, and handles to keep your rig safe during transportation and unloading. Now moving on to the sled. This sled is truly the star of the show. It's built with high quality aluminum alloy machining and a lightweight carbon fiber adjustable telescopic post. It features a 40 millimeter docking bracket with safety lock pin to keep the sled secure in between takes or to make camera adjustments. On the top stage, the camera mounting plate features a large silver fore and aft adjustment knob for moving the camera rig forward and backwards, as well as a left and right fine tune adjustment knob for even finer micro adjustments. It includes easy to read measurement markers when making fine tune adjustments to nail your dynamic balance. Once you've balanced the camera, use the two large silver knobs to lock the camera plate securely. It also includes a red safety button to lock in and secure the camera plate to prevent any accidents on set. In my test, there was absolutely zero play when using even the heaviest camera setups. Nothing slips, there's no manufacturing tolerance issues or micro vibrations that I can see in any of my footage. Below the locking mechanism, you have a 3G SDI port for video feed and a DTAP port for camera power and to provide accessory power in either 12 or 24 volts. You also have matching 3G SDI and DTAP ports on the other side for potentially a director's feed and a power wireless video or your follow focus motors. What I truly love about this rig is the included dual DTAP and SDI ports that run through the sled for a minimal clean wiring and rigging setup. Moving down the sled, we reach the gimbal. The hand grip has a great machine texture and tactile feel to it when operating. Your fingers don't slip when making fine tune adjustments to the sled and it feels just as it should. Below the grip is your quick release adjustment for raising or lowering the post to achieve your dynamic balance. In this example, we can see the rig in perfect dynamic balance with a drop time of around 2 seconds. When you achieve proper dynamic balance, the gimbal works as intended with no minor swaying to either side, which to me is an indicator of a high quality bearing that can support a heavy downward load. As we move down to the bottom of the sled, it features an adjustable universal monitor mount for all types of SDI and wireless monitor setups. You can adjust the monitor angle with a secure locking knob as well as do micro adjustments to the monitor rails. The rails include easy to read measurement markers. And now we move on to the bottom of the sled where it includes two V-mounts to securely attach your batteries as well as a third V-mount that can be attached via the rails below the sled for additional weight or extended power. It has an adjustable step-down module with voltage stabilization function which can protect the camera accessories and your batteries. You can adjust the battery angle to help achieve perfect dynamic balance. Once secured, the batteries have zero play, micro jitters, or any wobble when operating. Now moving on to the arm. The Lang Master 50 arm is well engineered and built like a tank. The arm can support up to 50 pounds total rig and sled weight. It has fine tune adjustment knobs for lift control on each arm which adjust spring tension for each arm section. My only pet peeve and disadvantage of this arm is the lack of separate lift and ride control to adjust your isoelasticity to make it easier to boom from the top range all the way to the bottom range. Having ride control helps isolate your body movement from the sled. These arms only include lift control, which limits the arm's adjustability. 
It includes your standard locking pin to mount the socket block, which connects between you and the arm. There's no noticeable creaks or unwanted sounds coming from the spring arm. Now moving on to the vest. The vest features high quality thick padding for your shoulders, chest, and back support and feels comfortable for extended use. It comes in at just over 10 pounds and is fully adjustable for all operator body shapes and sizes. It has a solid chest plate and thick padding that wraps around your shoulders, chest, and hips to disperse the weight evenly. I was able to operate for over an hour and I had zero operator strain or issues aside from sweating profusely. Depending on if you're right or left handed, you can move the socket block to either side for ease of operation, as well as raise or lower the socket block height for the spring arm. You can turn the bottom screws on the socket block to adjust the arm angle to prevent the rig from pushing away or moving too close to you. The Langmaster Stabilizer Kit includes all of the accessories and cables you need to get up and running. It includes a DTAP power cable, BNC video cable, two HD SDI cables, camera mounting screws, four counterweights, hex keys, and a screwdriver. Demo Shots I'm excited to share my own work as well as some high-budget viral music video work from the talented Steadicam operator, Tan Nguyen. Here's some shots and behind the scenes of me operating for part of a haunted house documentary, and you can see some smooth organic tracking shots of the talent exploring the haunted house maze. In this shot we do a tilt down and follow her outside onto the roof of the building, finishing with a whip pan as she bursts through the door. In these music video shots we can see a nice smooth tilt up and push in to follow the talent into the scene and smooth 360 shots going around the talent. In this shot we pan down from the sky and reveal the family scene as the camera dollies forward. For the dance sequences, there's a lot of quick push-in and pull-back shots to keep the energy up and complement the dancers in tempo. In this shot, the operator has the sled boom down and tilted up as he approaches the talent to do a nice 360. In this other music video, we follow the singer as he hops on the back of the truck to start the song, and we see some smooth ultra-wide tracking shots as the Steadicam operator walks backwards alongside the talent. In this final music video, you can see super smooth close-up dolly tracking shots of the singer and nice push-in shots during the song's crescendo. If you're learning to become a Steadicam operator and you're looking at buying your first serious rig, or if you're a working industry pro, the Langmaster Stabilizer is an affordable, high-quality Steadicam alternative that won't break the bank. I hope you guys really enjoyed my detailed review video today. Please leave any of your questions in the comment section below and I'll be sure to help out. You can follow me at DrewHit on Instagram for more camera gear reviews and behind the scenes to show you how I do what I do. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.